Hey everybody, I'm Tom Vassell. I'm Mike Delicio. Hello. And I'm Roy Kennedy. Today we are playing live through Freedom 5. This is a game that went on Kickstarter as of uh, two minutes ago. Oh, snap. Get you can it. find the link to the Kickstarter in the description below. This is a Dice Tower Essentials game, uh, which is a line of games I worked with with Arcane Wonders uh, that are games that I really like. This is a game that's been in the making for several years now. <laughs> When I first talked to Richard Launius, I, I have always enjoyed his Defenders of the Realm mm. game. Uh, and I when I heard that he was making a soup uh, 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 hero a version, hero version, version of a heroic version of this game, I uh, I'm on board, right? Mm. And then and then and then it became a Sentinels of the Multiverse style game, which is even more exciting because I actually know these characters. Right. Well, I know. Three, well, the three characters we're playing today. <laughs> and I know the villain. Yeah, that's true. I actually hate this guy, Baron Blade. Yeah, he's oh, for sure. This is the one that I've played a bunch of times. Well, he's the, the kind he's of like the base, guy. and he's mm -hmm. the base one here. So this is a fully cooperative game, and we are in this city here defending against whatever the villain might be. Um, in this case, it's Baron Blade, and we'll talk about that in a second. We're playing through different uh, scenarios. We're playing through this one here, which is Bad Moon Falling. This is a, a scenario we're going to play through and lose. So, <laughs> let yes. me give you some, some caveats here. First of all, this is not the final production copy. The miniatures, they look pretty cool. A lot of the art is finished for sure, um, but a lot of the stuff will change. And you can go to Kickstarter page to see how things are going to change. Even the rules may not be 100% correct. Or there might be tweaks and things mm. made in the rules mm -hmm. and or the scenario and or stupidity on my part as we go through and explaining the rules. So, with that being said... So, any mistakes that are made, we can attribute to Tom Vassell. <laughs> well, that is... that <laughs> is No mistakes that Roy and I make are responsible to us. That It'll is be... not an incorrect thing, but <laughs> we will be ascribing the loss, yeah. if we lose, to Mike Delicio. No. I am legacy. I, I don't lose. <laughs> That's true. All right. So, but first we're going to go through the scenario. I'll read through the thing, and then we're going to show you close-ups of the different characters and cards and things. So Let's do it. All right, Ivan Ramanat, son of a prolific USSR weapons developer, still around. USSR. <laughs> sure, yeah, yeah. Grew up in Lithuania during the Cold War when the USA sent a team of superhumans led by the world's first legacy to disrupt the creation of a Soviet doomsday device. The resulting conflict left young Ivan an orphan, which he could have used to do something great with his life. Mm -hmm. Sorry, commentary. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Years of fending for himself and picking up the piece of his father's work warped Ivan into a cold-hearted, power-hungry dictator known as Baron Blade. Mm. Was he made of Baron? Okay, anyway. Mm. Eventually, his quest <laughs> for vengeance brought him to Megalopolis, where he has suffered numerous defeats at the hand of the Freedom Five. Mm -hmm. Today, we're, we're the Freedom Three. <laughs> yep. Two of the Freedom Five, Sub-Zero and... Uh, they had paid vacation. Right, they're on a vacation. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> While the nature of their feud has escalated over the years, one thing has remained consistent. The Baron's obsession with revenge against the Parsons family and his hatred... Is that your last name? Uh, yes, Paul Parsons. <laughs> I'm fine. <laughs> he has no problem with me. <laughs> we'll find and it. And his hatred for America's beloved legacy. That's also That's you. also me, yes. We're good. Yeah. Now, after finally perfecting his father's designs, the Baron needs to siphon a little extra power from the city before he is re ready to reveal the Terra Luna Beam Cannon, mm. a machine capable of pulling the moon from Earth's orbit and bringing this story to a catastrophic conclusion. I was 13 when I lost everything, when the Parsons took my family from me. But I soon have my revenge, says Baron Blade. I'll need a little chaos, some muscle, and a bit of fear to keep those pathetic heroes tending to their sheep. I He's love so how it's like all like He's very so comic dramatic. booky. I tell ya. All right, he says. So misunderstood the part. Legacy has bested every challenge I've thrown at him. This is all written in comic style, by mm -hmm. the way. That's awesome. Uh, he is in essence indestructible. His precious, precious planet, however, is not. And I will rip the moon from orbit unless I am given Paul Parsons himself. Wow. Does he know you're Paul Parsons? He probably he doesn't. Might, he, you don't think? I don't think so. All right. So let's start off here. We're going to show you some, some close-ups of things. We'll start with the heroes. So that's Paul Parsons. That, that, that's, that's, that's Mike's my character. That's my real life, my alter ego. He helps old ladies across the street. And he Thwok or thock. <laughs> Legacy punches old ladies across the street. I get to use my oh, no. special wild... 
Legacy die. That looks a whole lot less special when you put it in. Like That's that. a special die. Look at that. All right, all right. I help him out. Tyler Vance. Look at that guy. You think he's full of muzzles. You see in the background, it looks like he's a robot. But it's actually a suit. Oh, shoot. He flies. Bunker, look at that guy. Bunker is a machine. You should throw some of the miniatures and up there, too. In, oh, that's uh, a good yeah. idea. I mean, uh, Maybe. Bunker's not going to fit on that thing. Look that's at that guy. Awesome. That suit is humongous. I love it. You can get a glance. You can get an idea anyway. There you go. All right. And then finally, Tachyon. She is, her real name is Dr. Meredith Stinson, who is apparently working in five different places <laughs> at the same time. And she's why? Because she's super speed. Boom. Tachyon. Fleet of foot. That's a good picture. That's great. Ooh, I, I feel the movement. All right. You may re-roll all dice one time each time you roll the dice. I like it. That is definitely a Roy ability. Let's yeah. do it. <laughs> all right. We well, we're not done yet. So the bad guys. So here's Baron Blade. So Baron Blade is kind of a pain in the neck. Now he has uh, his uh, hit points here is seven, three plus number of heroes, which you might think would be pretty easy. Yeah, Here's the problem. He's sitting in a mobile defense platform, which has 20 hit points. Mm. So we're going to have to take that out before we can do anything to him. He also brought three villains with him. First, we have this guy who I love. <laughs> freight train. It's actually, I think it's freight train. I, I, I'm pretty sure that's a. Really? I think freight, freight train, train is a great. Yeah, that's a great turn of phrase. Maybe I just can't read. You're right. It is freight train. Yeah, I still want to know, like, if he wants to take a nap, does he have to take that whole thing off? <laughs> I always ask us about. Super I don't know. Guns. I mean, he obviously is able to eat, you know, because he's not a small guy. And... All right. Well, then we got Glamour, who. The mysterious Madame. I like her special ability, though. <laughs> yeah. Well, I'm glad we're playing with some uh -huh. people with special ability. And then we have Ambuscade. Aha. Uh -huh. They all have defense and counterattacks, though. And yeah, they, they do. They're going to be tough. They're going to be tough to take out. Again, I want to point out, I plan to lose this. I mean, I plan to win it. I expect to lose. Correct. That, that's the thing. So, uh, we, I've already done a lot of the setup of the board itself. So if you take a look here at the board, you can see that the board is made up of 30 different locations here in the city. We have a main board down here. We keep track of special justice bystander cards, anarchy and scheme cards. Mm -hmm. It's a big mess of just badness all over the place. Mm -hmm. uh, each of us is starts in different locations. We all had a choice except Mike had to start in the Freedom Tower. <laughs> the rest of us could have started with him, but we decided to start in various locations. Actually, seeing how the board is set up, I think I'm going to start in Freedom Tower too. Send me over to Freedom Tower. Because I, I have an alternate thing I can start there. And it seems like there's not as much not a lot happening going on over there. And I am a, a wrecking machine. I mean, and that's not a joke. Mm -hmm. I am a wrecking machine. Um, the different villains are here. Each of the villains has a colored base. And this is important because they're kind of in charge of their colored henchmen. Gotcha. You'll notice these little meeples all over the city. And these guys are henchmen. They're just everywhere. And we got to clear these guys out because the more henchmen is, the, the, the badder things get. There's also anarchy tokens, which could be all sorts of things. People blowing up malls. Um, attacking nuns. Oh, um, oh goodness. Uh, blowing up a mall full of nuns. <laughs> I... I'm running out of... Are they all just of, related to malls and nuns? <laughs> I've run out of combinations. Yeah. <laughs> None shall pass... Okay, oh, really <laughs> that was awful. Oh, man. We have nowhere to go but up The, the here, height right? of comedy. Nowhere to go but up. <laughs> I made myself laugh, but that's okay. <laughs> Oof. All right. All right, so we're going to go through this, and mostly instead of me going through a rules dump on you at the beginning... We're just going to go through a little bit as we play. So, but I'll explain. What we're doing here is when I when we play through this comic book, essentially, we have a, a set of rules that we're following, and also some seeds of chaos and different things like this. Mm -hmm. um, we follow these special rules, but when we when we defeat two villains, mm -hmm. or if the mastermind track reaches five, and you know, there's a token oh, that remind us, then we turn the page and it gets worse. Okay. And then same thing gets worse, and then we win or lose. Okay. Technically, we could lose a long time before that happens, but let's assume that that won't happen. So does the Mastermind's track actually start on two, or is it just sitting there? Uh, I'm pretty sure it started on two. I will okay. go back and double... double. Just want to make sure. I don't want to make things harder on us than we need to, right? 
It definitely doesn't start on the part that says start, right? Well, that's why I was. That's why I asked. I didn't. <laughs> oh yeah, I forgot to put a mastermind token on number thirty. Uh oh. So there's a mastermind token. Well, there. I was feeling good until then. Now we're done. Uh, I feel like we started on two. Yep. Start the tracker pawn on two. Oof. Okay. Oh, we each get one special card. So uh -huh. we have a special card that you'll special. be able to start off with. Never give up. I have team 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 up. I have team up also. I have uh, play any time to enable any hero to re-roll any number of dice. Hmm. Did Tom just watch the Blues Brothers? No, but <laughs> <laughs> wasn't there uh, at the beginning of one of the Lethal Weapons? Where there was a stroller bouncing down the steps and a car coming and a nun, the baby flying out. Maybe I'm. Uh, I'm wrong I think that was Sister Act. No, it was not Sister <laughs> Act. <laughs> Sister Act Two. Sounds more like the Untouchables. They had the the baby stroller going down the. Yes, but they spoof that in a one of the. Um, naked Guns. I said Lethal oh, Weapon. Oh, Naked Guns. Naked Guns. <laughs> That's yes. Very different than Lethal Weapon. Wow. Okay. Not that Lethal Weapon. Naked Guns. That All would right. make sense. Yes. We're totally getting off track here. Let's do this. All right, so Mike is first. Yes. So the first thing Mike, well, we'll just have Mike go first. So okay. first you have your private life phase. So each of us has our card here, and these cards can flip over like Mike already showed you. Mm -hmm. And you can start your private life phase, and there's a couple actions you can only do in your private life. And most of your actions that you have, you can only do when you're a superhero. Mm-hmm. If you stay in your private life, though, no bad guys will attack you. At the end of your turn, each henchman that's in your spot is going to hit you for a damage. We'll draw damage tokens. Damage tokens are a real mm -hmm. pain in the neck. You take five damage tokens, and we advance the hero track by two, the, the, the mastermind track by two. So that's a bad thing. Yeah. Um, so we already have a blue henchman. I don't know how he got in Freedom Tower. That seems, yeah, but, that seems like... Uh, what I is think Freedom he, Tower? So anyway, heroes never suffer damage from henchmen in this location. Okay. Oh, never mind it. He's, he's in the lobby. That's right. If overrun, we advance the scheme track one space. Yeah, we really do got to kill We do got to deal with him, yeah. But you're better. Oh, no, you're not. I'm better at whooping on anyone. So each All of right. us has some stats. Actually, let's show a stat card, Mike, there. Sure. When we fight henchmen, uh, you're going to roll dice equal to the number of henchmen in a spot. So let's say there's three green henchmen in a spot that Mike's fighting. He'll roll three dice, and he needs to get four or higher because that's his mind. Mm -hmm. So Mike is best at body, terrible at tech. Yes. Because he doesn't need tech because he's super strong. Right. Yep. I, on the other hand, have a three in tech and a five in spirit. So. Beep. All right. All right. So uh, so Mike's first. So so first is the, the private life phase. Are you going to do any of the private life phase? Mostly, they tell you heal right, and you right. can do personal tasks. So you probably aren't going to do anything private. No, life. because. Well, the, also your special ability. Yeah, my special ability I'm definitely going to do. Yeah, because the only thing in my private phase would be if I needed to heal or if I needed to complete a personal task, neither of which apply. But I am going to do my sense danger because as Paul Parsons, I can sense danger and I may look at the top scheme card. We can discard it or place it back on the top of the deck. Now, the question is, we don't really know necessarily what's better or worse because this is the first scheme card. Why don't you show people a scheme card? Okay. Be so at. when we draw scheme cards, that's going to be adding different things. So that's going to add um, a henchman and a uh, bystander, bystander to, 13. to 13, two red henchmen to 18, a blue henchman, and then Baron Blade himself is going to be moving to number 10. Well, probably Baron Blade. Someone's moving to number 10. Yeah. I'll look that up. Um, if, it might be the blue if villain. If less who moves than three to mastermind tokens are active, we add one to the location of an active villain. And we have how many? We only have one. So we'd be doing that. Now, I don't know if that's good or bad. I don't know either, but you know what? There are scheme cards that say nothing happens. Then we're putting this at the bottom of the right. deck. I mean, I don't see how it's... I mean, now watch right. the next one. will be like, draw the next <laughs> six and activate them. <laughs> you lose card. All right. I, look, I'm thinking I'm going... I'm going all in at this point. So here's my thoughts. I've got five actions, and I can move up to two. If I flip over to my legacy uh, side... Show us how it's done. I can move twice. It would take two actions to move here to the port of Megalopolis. All right? Once I get there, I can take an action to attack those three. I do have some cards that would help me uh, to potentially do that. And then if I can get rid of all them... I can either interact with that anarchy token, or I can start punching uh, Fright Train. In, if there's, in if there's grill. nothing else I'm a fan of, it's punching Fright Trains. Okay, so the only other thing I might consider 
is that I can draw three ability cards here, but if I do that, I'm taking three of my five actions just to get here. Whereas if I don't draw extra cards, I'm only using two of my actions. But cards are good. Mm -hmm. cards You're going to draw good. two cards at the end of your turn. Am I? But I'm going to be potentially spending cards on this attack. Uh, just to clarify, my name is um, Bunker. It's mm -hmm. not Legacy, so I feel like Legacy right. needs to make some Legacy's choices gonna for go. himself. Legacy's going to take one action. And Otherwise, he's gonna, I'll be called an Alpha Gamer. He's going to draw three ability cards because I think cards are good. Wrong choice. No, that was a great <laughs> choice. I feel so good about that. All right, so that was one action. I'm going to take two of my other actions to move. Actually, these should probably be flipped to the exhausted side. And I'm going to go one, two for one, and then here for my second one. Now I have two more actions, and now I start fight punching. All right, so I do a attack, and I get a roll, my legacy die. Oh, so you have to roll well. four dice. Four dice, and that white die is a wild, so it's so going to count as a red. So you need threes or higher? Threes or higher. Oh, man, legacy rocks. Okay, so... I take that back! No, because I can play two Surge of Strength cards to modify... Oh, I don't need to do two of them, just one of them. All right, so one, no, I do need to do two of them. Modify each die by one, so this would get this one to a three, this one to a three, and those would be... Wait, what? I know, he wasted a lot. He could have just re-rolled the dice, but all right. Oh, wait, 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 do I have a re-roll? No, but you had another action left. I don't, why would I want to... Because I want to use that action all to right, interact right. with... So Mike has killed these three red meeples. All ah! right, okay, so these are gone. He just came in and punched everyone. All right, so now I have one more action remaining, and I can do one of two things if I understand correctly. I can either punch Fright Train, or I can interact with this... Yeah, but the punch Fright Train... Mm -hmm. Okay, so now, to attack a villain... Mm -hmm. So he, he he cannot attack a villain unless you get rid of the, oh, the, the henchman there. To attack a villain, he's going to need to spend cards that give him dice to do so. Red dice. Oh, it has to be red dice? He's red. Oh, so then I'm, I'm not going to attack him. I'm going to interact with this uh, token interaction, anarchy token. Draw an anarchy card uh, matching the color. Well, look, the top card happens to be red, so okay. here we go. Show everyone what this anarchy card looks like. Uh, hopefully... You uncover a smuggling operation, moving guns, drugs, and muscles. It's nuns doing it. Um, <laughs> you can test your brain or your body. Gee, I wonder which will be. It will body. be body. Okay. So, so four, four. tests. Now, each, each time Legacy rolls dice, he rolls the white Legacy die as well. What? That's crazy. All I right. love it. So you, you need to yellow. get threes here. I gave you four dice because you're rolling four dice. Got it. Okay, so I'm the rolling. color of dice doesn't necessarily matter. It only matters when there's henchmen that two different colors in a spot. Mm. Um, yeah, that makes sense. And then you roll the different colors. Other than that, doesn't really matter. All right, so I need threes or higher, and if I'm, I'm, I'd like to get three or more successes, right? Yeah. I would imagine. The okay. board is a lot. We're looking at a down view here, folks. Most of the time when you play this game, you won't be six feet above the board. Right. So for some of you saying you're having a hard time like seeing that. it, you would, it, you can see it much better in person. Okay, so I got three successes. I can also Actually, I got four successes. Well, what was it saying in the card? Currently going All right. on. You capture the operations boss as well as the cargo. Remove this anarchy token and defeat all red henchmen on any one location in the city. So I think 18 looks like a good place, right? Oh, yeah, you rock. Boom. So that's it. That's all five of my actions. I feel like that was a good first turn. You stopped the smuggling ring. And now at I'm the end of my you. turn, thank you, I... Draw two cards, you said? You draw two cards, and okay. then the bad guy is going to go. No, I don't like that idea. All right. Okay. So. Uh, oh, wait a minute. That that anarchy token does not go away. It goes onto my justice card, which is remove any two different colored anarchy tokens. Place each one removed on this card to track your, pr track your progress. And if I get another one of a different color, I'm going to get a reward. All right. So the... Uh, what does Baron Blade do? Nothing. Draw a scheme card. This is the one that, <laughs> that, we, did, that, we, that we didn't take. All right, here we go. What does it show us? So, first we add a green and a mastermind token. Oh, what? That's 24. worse. To where? 24. 24. So, a green uh, henchman and a mastermind at 24. Okay. Can I get there? No, there's no line. All right, then we add two blue henchmen to four. Over here in the West Garden. Okay. And then we add... Then we add a henchman. 
Yellow to yellow to 21. 21. And what do we? And I is, believe move only if three henchmen are present. There are three henchmen present, so it looks like. Where's the yellow go? villain is going to go. Oh, the mastermind, I guess, is going there. Is that the mastermind or is that the yellow villain? Well, the mastermind is yellow in this particular ah, okay. So he's going to move to 21 as well? If less than three mastermind tokens are action, add one mastermind token to the location of an active villain or a mas or mastermind. So, Well, there are less than three of those. Yeah, so we're going to be moving Baron to 21. Is that correct? Does yep, I'm going, to look at how the ma I'm going to look at how they move here just to make sure okay. we're doing this correctly. Does he move with his, uh, his his mobile defense platform? It says mobile, so I bet it would, wouldn't it? I don't know if he moves with the mobile defense platform. It says uh, eh, each time villains defeat it. Um, I assume he moves with it, but I would think so. It looks like it's it this there. big. It'd be great if he didn't move with it. Yeah, it's the mastermind's base. I don't know. All right, villains face. So blah blah blah. The villains learn about scheme cards. I guess I should have. I, I missed the scheme card page. Scheme cards. Scheme cards. Scheme cards. This is the most fun part of any game. That's right. When a guy is flipping through the rule book and everybody else is saying, "Well, I'm hey, ready. I'm oh, ready to go because it's going to be." There is no yellow villain in this scenario, so we may ignore that card. Hello. It says magical text from the Hello. sky. Hello. Okay. It's be and yes, fast. Baron Blade moves with the platform. Okay. okay. Great. Move Two questions up. Three henchmen. Okay. So we do add a mastermind token to the location of an active villain or the mastermind. So we can put one here, or we can put one there. I'd say we kind of put it here because he could. You can deal with it then, right? I suppose so, yeah, on my next turn, because there's no henchman there. We hope you can deal with it. All right. Look, you saw my last turn, right? That was a good turn. Okay. All right. All right, guys, I can just blow stuff up. Then make it happen. Problem is. <laughs> yes. I'm a slow-moving man. How are you against green? Because we've got a nasty-looking green right next to I'm you. I'm fours. I can't hit. I want to destroy green. No, I'm. But you're fast. You can get over to green, probably. How fast can you move, Roy? Three. You can I get there move. in one action. If I play okay, a card, well, I can let's, let's go, go here. anywhere on the board. Let, let's, let's use my one special action, ability first. Okay. okay, I can choose a hero to draw three ability cards and keep oh. all cards one color. So, Roy, I'm going to let you do that. You what get to it? draw three and keep all the cards of one color, and then I can move to that location to that color. Oh, look at I that. guess I'll pick blue. Oh my maybe. word! All right, nice. so I can go to any. I really blue like green though, so I'm going to discard. No, I'm just kidding. Unfortunately, blue is the thing I'm worst at. Worse. I'm also bad at blue. All right, all right. I'm going to do it, though. I'm going to move over to this blue spot yes. here. Yes. Now, was all that right. an action? That was not. That was not. Flip, 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 flip. Bunker. All right. Bunker is now going to just blow stuff up. Do it. <laughs> Omni Blast. So I play this as an action to defeat all henchmen at your location. Nice. And two henchmen from each adjacent location. Oh, oh that's Seems brutal. good. Boom, 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 boom. And boom there, two and four. <laughs> okay. I like it. However, I can well, well, don't get too excited. No! Anyway, I didn't really read the rest of the card. Deal one damage to villains and other heroes on your location. Okay, that's good. Okay, that's not bad. So one put damage to, to um, Glamour. How's your face look now, Glamour? <laughs> <laughs> all right, then remove all bystanders from your location and place an anarchy token there. Okay, there are no bystanders, so we put another blue anarchy token? Yeah, or? it doesn't tell us what kind to put, so we can put any color we want. Oh, but okay. I'll what put a green there. At? Yeah. Uh, there is no yellow, unfortunately. Oh. Then, uh, then I roll a die, and if I get odds, I put out another <laughs> anarchy token. Don't do it. All right. All right. That yeah. was very that was very scary actually. That <laughs> but, was. But. but that was awesome. But it, it added some bad things. However, there's anarchy tokens there. Now you can deal with them because there are no henchmen there. Good thing to note or, is uh once per turn on my turn as my uh, alter side here, I can choose an anarchy token at my location or an adjacent location and roll a die. If I get evens, I get to discard it. Oh, okay. So I can maybe get rid of one of those 50. if you can't ah, get rid of uh, it. I forgot. Whenever we place an anarchy, whenever we place a mastermind token, Baron Blade moves to that location. So oh. where do we put the last one? The last one? Oh, we put it here. here. Oh, <laughs> man. So he moves there, and we have to put out a, an anarchy a token of our choice. This is a pretty nasty looking spot. All right, you should probably go. Um... All right, so I did a great. That was a great. Oh, I'm, I'm done. I'm just gonna pass in the rest of my actions. Uh, I'm gonna do the anarchy token that's green. The blue one is tough. So 
We gotta find a green card. I'm very nervous about the green one. So is the deck, apparently. Who shuffled this? There we go. There we, we go. Did. So, there are rumors in the street that ruthless criminals are gathering at some unknown location. I'm rolling five dice. Whoa. Okay. I need three successes here. Fours or hires. Gotcha. I got a reroll. You gonna do it? I'm really nervous here, guys. You need to make it. Four successes. You, you need to roll good. One, two. Uh, okay. So, do you have anything that can help you reroll? Uh. No. Never give up. <laughs> Never play surrender. Play any time to enable any hero to reroll any number of dice. Good job. All I right. can reroll any number of dice? Any number of dice. Uh, I would say you, you keep the four and the five. Four probably. and the five, I'd keep, yeah. <laughs> You're like, thanks, Captain Obvious. You need two more, yeah. Alpha gamers, I only need one more. Okay. Never give up! <laughs> dun, 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 dun. Uh, you decipher the clues and capture what can only be described as an army. Examine and confiscate equipment, it becomes clear that these were Baron Battalion recruits. Discard this anarchy token. Boom. I'm proud of you. You destroyed the entire city and got and calmed them down afterwards. Like, don't worry about it. Don't worry about screaming it. Screaming on the other side of Megalopolis to never give up. Man, none of us are good at blue, are we? You're the best at blue. I'm at four. Yeah, I'm not good at blue. I don't have any cards in my thing. I, I'm gonna move from here. I think I'm gonna go rescue that bystander. Right. Yeah, do it. So I'm gonna move one. And is a bystander rescuing a bystander? It's a in token action? interaction at the very bottom. Got it. So I will discard this token and draw a bystander card. I got a, I rescued a movie star. Nice. Oh, nice. You would do great in the big screen, Sugar. Let me get you in touch with my agent. <laughs> 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 All right. For a reward, I may refresh it, unexhausted action token, or draw an ability card. Oh. I think the ability card is better. I, cards I'd rather, are good. I'd rather load up on those. Cards are good. Also, she is one... Um, Bystander. Okay. Once you get two bystanders, you discard those and you get a special card. I oh, think, or something. Oh, cool. I'll nice. look at that up. You get okay. something. But she's one. Um, also, I need to go visit the visionary here. She's in 29. That's pretty far away. So, whatever. I'll get around to getting her done. Uh, what was that card I just drew? Ooh. I only have. You have two more actions. I do. Man, Seems like you can go punch glamour, but I don't have any cards that give me what? You don't. You don't have. You have one blue die. Huh? I got that Omni Blast again. You guys want me to do it again? I can kill everything. That's where. No, you just... that's like a. I, I think that's like a, a move that should be used sparingly. Right. Because right. I don't want to keep adding these anarchy tokens. Mm -hmm. Right. Um. Yeah, I'm actually going to move back to where he's at, mm -hmm. and then. Play this card as an action to remove this token. Ah, oh, oh. dang it. Well, did, were you able to do that? Well, I, I mean, you get to do it for... That's fine. You use the card to do it. Could you not move and do it somewhere else? I don't think I can move in this form. Look on your move thing there. Does it show both? Because mine shows both. Oh, mine does show both. Yeah, yeah. So I could move and then do move it. Move and do it over here, maybe. or Yeah, that would be weird if you could not move as a civilian. You're right. right. I like to go downtown. <laughs> no. Superheroes only. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so I drew my card. So now bad guy's turn. So we draw the scheme card. Okay. Let me make sure I'm doing the bad guy stuff properly. Like, Hopefully um, it okay. it's not as devastating. And I don't take any damage because there's no henchman there. Right. All right, so I had a blue and a scheme token to 29. Uh -oh. Blue and a scheme token of 29. All right. Two reds to one, Roy. Ugh. All right, that's getting and close to And a yellow to 17. Oops. All right. Ugh. And then we place an anarchy token on one red location with three henchmen. Number one. Now we don't really got an option there. It's red. Yeah. All right. All right, Roy. Woo. All right, well, that's... I'm good at red... Um, but this says I need to defeat green to get that bonus. Um, uh, I guess I... So normally you can only get rid of anarchy tokens if there are no bad guys You have there. to get rid of the henchmen first. So mine just says once per turn, choose an anarchy token on your location or an adjacent location and roll a die on evens, you discard the token. So you can still do that, yeah. Yeah, so that goes, bypasses it. That sounds like it to me. Um, I'm thinking I kind of want to go... 
One, two, three, ah, one, two. I can't get up there in three movements, can I? Can you come down and punch this guy? I'm really bad. It, it, I'd have We're to do blue bad dice, at blue, right? Though. But yeah, it has to be blue dice. Yeah. Well, you're fast, though. Can't you, like, get to. Can you get to. What are you good at? I can get to anywhere on you the can board. Get to here I can get all move. the way over there. I can get all the way over there just by playing this action card. And it said, well, I'd have to be in hero form to do that. So I need to, I need to do, I need to roll for one of these while I'm in this form. So uh, over here, go right? here. Yeah. And then I'll go ahead Wait, and. How, oh, you can get over in human three. form? Yeah, yeah, you can move in human form. Yeah. And then um, I'm going to roll a die and try to get an even. If I get an even, I just get to discard the anarchy token. Ah. That would be an odd. So. But you could still. Interact Same. with it once you get rid of all those right. henchmen if you want to. So then I guess I'll flip over all right. um, to hero form, and then I'm going to try to attack green because I'm better at that. So you're rolling three green die. Three green dice. Um, nice. Uh, you want to hand him some green dice there? Looks like yeah. there's two there. Yeah, it doesn't, again, it doesn't, it doesn't matter. matter. But hey, you know. We got to be right. You roll the wrong colors. Right. Uh, I think it affects luck. I needed fours. four or higher. So that is a complete and utter whiff. Hold on. Let me make yeah, sure. Yeah, but, but that's only one action. He could just spend another whole action to oh, yeah, roll. Spin action to move. Spin action to attack. Yeah, I have nothing I can help. And then with. I will, oh. I can reroll all of my dice once. E I can reroll all my dice once each time I roll a die. So I'm going to oh, use that go. ability. Yeah, yeah. Of course. That Boom. all hits. That's a better thing. <laughs> That's na, 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 na. Na, 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 Got to check all the abilities na, here. Na, na, That's right. Na, na. The question is, should I do the anarchy token or should punch I... Punch the dude in the face. We do got to beat the these guys do, up at yeah. some point. But you have to play cards from your hand. It has to be green. That give you... Green dice. Green. Although I will gladly throw in my team up to give you two more dice. I don't have that. I could do this to get two dice myself. And then this would up. give you four. Do you have any greens? I have this as well, but then I wouldn't be using the ability on it. Right? Or is it sure, just for the dice? Sure, but I mean... Okay, that's he, fine. But he Let's needs seven. All right, so and, but he's got some defense, probably. Yeah, okay. He's so now we're fighting at Buscade. So his defense. Attacking heroes, you will take a damage for each die roll of one. Ugh. Don't roll one. No, you get a re-rolls. You I get know, a re-rolls. But okay. it says attacking, every re-roll. And he has all a counter strike. Attacking heroes will suffer damage equal to the total number of heroes that are attacking plus one. So you're gonna take two no matter what. You draw these two. You'll be able to heal. And then okay. after the attack, he moves to a random location and heals two damage. <laughs> oh, I hate this guy so much. Yeah. And he haven't even swung at him yet. Yeah, you gotta beat him. You gotta try to get him in one or two hits. Okay, let's do it. Okay, yeah, so I'll be mean, like, maybe you can follow up I'm with yeah. five, right? With your card, right? Are you turning in your... More. I'm definitely turning in my card. Uh, more. Never. No, that was mine I played. I need one more die. So that's okay. two, four, five. So here, folks, just so you know, if one of us was in the same location we could and up. we were in our hero form, we could also play cards that would give extra dice. Right. I'm going to uh And now that roll is there, we may come in. Oh, no. Oh, my god. I'm going to reroll all those dice. That's horrible. <laughs> That would have been three damage just off the bat. Roy gets a bad roll in the first one just to get him yeah, out I, of the Yeah, I got to get it out of the way. Right. And then I roll solid gold. That's better. I mean, Still not enough. But. Two hits. That means he's going to move and then heal those two hits. I just did to mm, him. Yeah, pretty much. That is correct. But, but you get another. You don't I mean, take any. Oh, you do take two damage <laughs> from his counterattack. Uh, counterattack is just straight two damage? Damage equal total number of heroes that are attacking plus one. Wow. So here's your first damage. You can't use blue power cards until you heal that. Wow. And your second one, uh, you need to put an action token on top of this one. <laughs> one okay. that you haven't used, I assume. Yeah. But he could attack okay. him again, theoretically, if he had the cards for No, because after you attack, he moves to a random oh. location. Oh. So if random location reveals scheme, and he goes to number 12. All right, so he goes up to Zhang Park. Oh, rough. That was... That was not, not good amazing. at all. Not great. How are you feeling about that? But it was a good token? way to show <laughs> how to attack a villain. Right. How not to do it. Can you heal now? He can heal. I, I can't heal in this form, right? Can't you switch back? Or no? No. You, you, switch. you switch at the beginning of your at turn. At the beginning of your turn, you can heal him back. I guess I should try to do the anarchy token here. You're in 20, right? Yeah. Yeah. 
Uh, I wouldn't mind if you left the Anarchy token for me just so I can get this reward, but you don't have to do that. Mm, I'm going to play the HUD goggles to take uh, Blinding Speed back into my hand. Okay. Um, and that wasn't an action. Right. Uh, is there a specific space I need to be? I can play Blinding Speed to be able to wreck somebody. Oh, I can't. Did you start with your justice card? Is that your justice card there? Yes. Oh, I, okay. sh I should have put the green guys I defeated. I defeated I'm three green two. guys. Oh, yeah. There. Yeah, if you can get that counterfeit ring. Yeah, What's the reward great. for that? Um, I can flip this card any time to add two um, to any green combat or skill test. Got it. And then discard <laughs> it from the victory stack. All right, we'll get you. We'll get you next time. Mm -hmm. I'm going to just play Blinding Speed for my last one and go to here. And when I do that, it defeats this guy. Beautiful. Okay, so you take no damage because there's no thing right there. You draw there. two cards. Okay. And then we and do then we our scheme. scheme. All yeah, right, a scheme. green and a mastermind token go to seven, which okay. also means he moves to seven. Baron Blade does. Okay. He is floating around all over the place. Yeah. Two yellows go to three. Okay, oof. And a blue goes to five. Okay. Right, um, right where Bunker's at. And the blue villain moves there. Well, they're already there. They're already there. It, but only if three henchmen... Well, they're already there. Each hero may either heal one damage or draw an ability card. Um, oh, I didn't ability. know some of these were good. Yay! I will draw an ability card. I'm going to heal this Do the one damage. I, yeah. The one that gets rid of my actions. All right, all right, ladies and gentlemen. I'm, I'm feeling good now. I'm, I'm Omni Blasting, Mike. You're only busting me just to show you who's the real leader of this team. <laughs> Ridiculous. <laughs> I think we all saw what happened on that last turn. All right. So, Freight Train is red. Uh, Freight. Now you're calling him Freight. Yeah, shoot. Freight Train is red. Um, Freight Train shows it sounds like he would be at Universal Studios. In the, what's, let's take a look at his. What is, he, what is he going to do to me? Uh, I modify each die by minus one as his defense. And, ah, uh, two unblockable damage. But you got to you got to go big if you're going for these guys. Yeah, I think we almost need to have. Uh, do we need to be teaming up on them, or like, should I fly over? I don't. Have you just want to be. Ooh. You just want to be rolling a hand. If full I could get over to dice. you, let's see if I can do that. Yes. Okay, Tom. We're gonna. No. Nope. You, you don't have any blue cards. Oh, oh. Are we working together? Yeah. One. If we had a card, then. <laughs> okay. I'm. I'm like all set to beat up on the red guy. If if you. If you stay there, yeah. at, if you're there at the end of your turn, I'll come in and we will, we will whop him. Okay. Well, okay. Well, I'll come. I'll well, come. not really. I mean, but I would love to kill Freight Train because when he moves, he smashes stuff. Okay. Makes so here's what anarchy. I'm thinking. I'm gonna go up to 20. I'm gonna go up to the Meg Convention Center, deal with that anarchy Center. token, and then come back down here, perhaps. Yeah, sure. Man, I ha I hate I hate all these guys. I hate I hate Freight Train. I hate Glamour. I hate Baron Blade, and I hate. Oh, yeah. Roy. See, yeah. See. Okay. So there's no reason for me They're to all go. Just bad guys. There's no reason for me to go back to my alter ego because all I would do there is heal, and I don't need. No, you. no, no. What about the other building on your other side of your card? Oh. Wasn't there something cool there? Yes, yeah, so I can look at the top of the scheme card. So let's do that. Thank you yeah. for remembering that. All right. Now we now we uh, will look at the numbers here because this actually this actually matters. Running out of time. Okay, so 11's not bad. 16. Two henchmen to 16. Is that overrun it? It does overrun it. Yeah, that would be a and little I can't, bad. And I'm not good on tech, so it's not like I can get over there and deal with that. I'm good at tech, but yeah. And 14, that's where the... We'd be advancing the scheme. Oh, and the red guy's moving to 14. One, two, three. Yeah, see, and we'd also be advancing the scheme track one space. Oh, yeah, let's get rid of that piece of garbage. Boom. All right, yeah, that's good, a rough good call. One. Good call on that. All right, so now I sense danger as Paul Parsons, but it's time for Legacy to come out and do Make it happen. Bum, 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 All right, so bum, 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 I'm going to take bum, one bum, action bum, to move I'm changing the notes slightly for copyright there. infringement. Okay, <laughs> and then uh, we're going to... Encounter that green anarchy token. Oh boy. Which isn't great for me because I'm a four on that, but. Okay. Police reports indicate that local gangs are merging. Something mm. terrible is stirring within a city. Four dice on green. Okay. And then I also get my white die. 
Man, I'm so jealous of your ability. You should be. It's pretty good. <clears throat> All right, so four, and I need what fours? How many successes do I need, Tom? Two is okay. Three is great. Okay, so fours are better. Show us how it's done. Okay, so I got three. You subdue the gang leaders and deliver their new recruits to the police. Remove this anarchy token and any five henchmen from the city. Yeah! Okay. That's good, so we can make things not explode. Yeah, so get one from here, one from one, one from 16, one from 21. Man, that's awesome. Okay. That was really good. And... Oh, 24. I, oh, we have one more, right? Did we have one more to get rid of? Yeah, we got oh, rid of one okay. four. Okay. And since I completed my justice card, the cursed mayor... Reward, immediately flip this card and re remove one mastermind token from any location and then add this card to my victory stack. Oh, nice. Boom. So where do we want to get? We've got one, two, three. I don't know that it matters. Well, you're close to that one. There's still three yellow here. It's a mastermind token I can get rid of, though. Oh, mastermind token. Yeah. Um, There's a ton down there in that corner. There are down here. In this, I think 30 is hard to get to. Maybe we just get rid of this one. Okay. That seems I'm good. gonna be coming back down here so we can team you, up on them. You the boss. All right, that's right. So get rid of this. You are the leader of our group. And it shows. All right, and these go back. <laughs> uh, that was only one action. Second action. I'm thinking. Do I want to deal with this anarchy token here? How do you deal with scheme tokens or? or All right, so tokens? scheme tokens. Or, when we do those. We're going to flip it over, and it's going to be one of five things based on the number. Okay. So I'm going to go one down One of them's there. bad. Okay. I'm going down here. When I say one of them's bad, I mean one of them's worse. Okay. <laughs> so that was two actions, right? No, it should be three, because I moved, I interacted, and then mm -hmm. I moved again. So that's three actions. Yep. I've got two left. I can either deal with this anarchy token, or I, I don't want to punch him, because I want to wait for you for that, because mm -hmm. we're going to team up Yeah, I, he better not move. I'm kind of. Do I go? Do I go in? Do I try for this mastermind token and just see? Because we haven't done that yet. Well, we have to. Because if we need to put out a mastermind token and we don't have one, we advance the track one. Oh, okay, so let's do it. Uh, there's no henchman here, so I can interact with this token. So I flip it, right? Good. Boom. Three. Three. For some reason, the gravity in this area is becoming unstable. You need to roll three dice, testing your mind. Well, but I'm also going to be rolling one more because I'm Legacy! All right. My mind, three dice plus he one. He says that a lot. He's like the Batman character. That's that comes right. In, I'm Legacy. <laughs> we, we know! Okay, so it's three mind. And how many successes do I need? You need two. Okay, so I need four higher on two of these. I did. All right, discard the token. and uh, Let me read the thing. You stop what appears to be a prototype device from emitting powerful waves of energy. Mm. Nice. Feel pretty good Beasted. about that. And I have one more action. You're good at red. You want I am. You I did, maybe just deal with that legacy, with that anarchy token. Yeah. Who shoveled this deck? I swear. It's remarkably bad. <laughs> wow. <laughs> red. All right. <laughs> I'm reshuffling. I'm now. rolling four dice to test. Uh, all right. So three. Plus one, plus one white die. Why? Because I'm Legacy! All right. I want three plus would be great. <laughs> that doesn't sound super heroic. It sounds pretty heroic to me. Well, I know, but you know when you put your look finger at that. Extra look, can you please look at the... Can, can we get this on camera? Would you <laughs> it look at that is roll? on camera. We can all see the dice. That's good. All right. You capture the operations boss as well roll. as the cargo. Remove this anarchy token and defeat all red henchmen in any one location in the city. So, I like it. I like it. This goes away, and I think we're going to get rid of ones. Or Boom. do we want 14s? Ones. Ones? Okay, there we go. Boom. Can I just say... I really wish, though, you had rolled that when attacking the main bad guy right in your spot. I would have been nice. That would have been great. But, a great roll. But you, you, know, as, you as, told me to wait. As so. it is. It's and then I draw two. And what's our hand limit? 12 or something? Are you close? 8. No, I'm at, I'm at 10 now. All right. I don't want to... I don't want to... You don't want to put pressure on me? No, no. I'm just saying I don't want to declare an MVP of the All game right, already. Scheme, add a dude to scheme. 1. And a mastermind token up there. Ooh, two that's... greens to 9. Two greens to 9. He moves here when this comes, right? Yes. All right. And a blue and a blue boss go to four. Uh, uh, blue goes to four. Okay. Oh, he doesn't move there because there needs to be three. Okay. If three or more mastermind tokens are active, 
which there are. Remove one and advance the scheme one space. We need to remove one. Um, want to get, get rid of, of one? one yeah. If not, place this card next to the scheme track. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And I had so, gotten rid of one of them, too. Just wasn't about that. enough. Wasn't enough. All right, Booker, let's do some damage. Oh, hang on first. Flip, flip, flip. I can choose here to draw three ability cards. Keep all the cards of one color. Draw. Are you sure? Because I'm at ten. Yeah, but you only have to keep all the cards of one color. Okay. And I need you to draw a red Thank so that I can you, get good. to the red. One, two, three. I can keep the red. Yes. Okay. And then, and then I can move to the red. These get discarded, flip, flip, right? Flip, 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 flip. I'm there, baby! I'm assuming those get discarded. All right. All right, let's start punching fools. All right, we're going to fight him for my first action. Mm -hmm. So I'm playing three cards. This is Now, this is risky, right? I have these cards that are all red dice, but I could also play them as the card, which, oh, is, yeah. six is, two, which is a six is two successes. But I have to play it before we roll. Right, and I'm thinking I'm going to roll three, and then I'd be rolling an extra one for my All legacy. right, so I'm going to roll two. And yeah. play one as each six counts as two successes. Okay. Yeah. Between five, there's a... I'm actually rolling another die. Because I'm Legacy. That's gonna I've heard old. that said. That's going to get old. All right. So... <laughs> Did he say something about getting? It's going to? All I'm, right, already. All right, let me look at... Uh, let me Listen, just, everything Mike does is old. <laughs> that's outrageous. <laughs> <laughs> let, me <go> th <laughs> let me go through the, um, the team up. Okay. So we each commit ability cards, which I just did. Mm -hmm. um, so we match the color of the mastermind and the villain. So mm -hmm. we're doing that. And we can do bonus dice. We choose the hero dice. So you will attack first. Oh, I attack first. Well, I can choose. Oh, I got you. Okay. You see him in successes. Then you do damage. And then he'll get the... Uh, yeah. Um, uh, it doesn't really matter. Who's How many he, dice who's you got? Who's he going oh, go to counterattack? He... He counterattacks all of us. He's going to hit us all for um, two unblockable damage. Okay, that's fine. He's going to hit us no matter what. We, I mean, we're going to right. take the damage. What can you do? What can you do indeed? All right, so I need threes or what better can you do? here. So I've got two. Let me see if there's anything I can play to help with that. No sixes, I noticed. No, no sixes. Mm. Um, I don't know that there's anything I can play. Oh, 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 oh. It's magic. I could get one more success. Well, he's going to heal one. Okay, so let's go ahead. I'll play the Surge of Strength. That's going to make this a three. Actually makes this a five and this a six. Oh, oh that's two more successes then. Oh, perfect. Yeah, that's awesome. Count as two. And this is a two. Okay, so that's, I think, all I can do for that. All right, so you did four damage to him. Yes. Oh, not bad, not bad, not that bad, not bad. bad, not bad. I only get two dice. Come on, Thomas. One. So four damage to him. Okay. I'm going to only put three on him because he's going to heal one in a second. Okay. First he counterattacks us. We both take two unblockable damage. Okay. Two for you. Two uh, for me. Cannot use green power Cannot cards. use yellow or, or place yellow. Place an action token on that. Right, okay. not, not too shabby. Not too bad. Oh, oh, I'm sorry. No, I forgot. I probably should use my special ability. Okay. Anytime I take one or more damage, reduce the damage by, by one. Did oh, you just say good. it was irreducible damage? Uh. Shut up, Roy! <laughs> it says unblockable damage. Oh, okay. Well, what does that even mean, then? I would think he, if it's unblockable, I think you're going to get smacked. You're going to heal two Which at the beginning one? of your turn, though. <laughs> well, yeah, no, but listen, it says each time he suffers one or more damage, reduce the damage by one and deal one damage to the attacker. Oh. So, I don't, I mean, if I had to take the two damage, so be it. Yeah, but you... But I do want to do that extra yeah, damage yeah, to the yeah. attacker. Right. So... Either I way. will ask uh, any unknown watchers, Anybody do I get to, uh, right. to, does that work? Because it says unblockable damage, but here I can reduce the damage with one. So I'm actually not blocking it, I'm reducing, reducing it. <laughs> hey, either way, whatever. But either way, I want to know if I hit him with the damage. So either way, we'll keep moving. And then so how after that, he moves to a random location, and, and uh, he's going to move there no matter what. He goes to number two. So how much damage have we done to him? One? No, no, three. Three. And if my thing works, he gets another another one for okay. four. Oh, and we need to get him down nine. Oof. Yes. Yeah, we have to team up on these you guys. You have to team up. And unfortunately, I played my flight cards. I played my cards that allow me to go anywhere. Hey, if I would have had a red, I would have gone down there and helped. All play. right, so then I'm going to move here for two. Those get discarded, right? Yeah, yeah. I'm going to move here for my second action. Oh, nice. Going to uh, rescue some bystanders now? Well, I got to kill the yellow guys first. I'm You're gonna, good but I'm attack, a three. though. 
So my third action, attacking right. those guys. Wrecked nice. them. For my hey, fourth action, bystander. bystander rescuing frightened citizens. Uh oh. But I gotta expend one of my extra, ac my last action, waiting for the police. Okay. However, that is two, two citizen tokens, which oh, nice. does something cool. They I'll let you get a second. special, right? You get another special card, is what you said before. I, I know, but I want to make sure because I, I know I said it, but I, I may not have been correct. Uh, I like it. Bystanders. Get a special card. Yep. So my special card now I have Quiet Night. I can place it in anyone's turn to prevent drawing any scheme cards in mm -hmm. their villain phase. Okay. I would prefer not to use that right sure. now sure. because. You can also save it for double dice. Well, I want to save it for like the situation we were just in mm -hmm. where Mike. I want Mike to stay there, and I don't want the guy to accidentally run right, away. Right, 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 right. Gotcha. Before we beat on him. I can't rescue that person because I just used my last thing. Yep. What do these uh, Justice Rewards cards do? Do we know? I still want to know if I hit him back with one damage. Right, right, right. Which I don't know yet. So if, if someone could tell me... I, I, he says unblockable damage, so that's fine. So right. we take the... Oh, yeah, I'll take the other damage. It was it was another yellow. It was another yeah. yellow. I take the other damage. I just want to know that if I... Um, Attempted to, you can do the damage to him. Right, I just want to know if the damage hits him or not. All right, so then I draw two at the end of my turn. Do we know what the uh, justice reward cards do? Yes, uh, I'll look that up in a second. Okay. Okay. Um, why don't you do this while I look at it? Is right. there a way to heal? So we've got a yellow. Yes, you can heal. It's one of your actions. Okay, cool. Uh, we can. We need a yellow henchman, Roy, on eight. And we need a uh, mastermind token also on eight. Oh, dag. So he pops over here and then. Yeah, and we need two green henchmen on 20 in the Meg Convention Center. And Ooh. then we need a blue henchman, and the blue enemy goes to six. Uh, only if there's three? Uh, each, no, it doesn't say that. It just shows him moving there. Okay. And then it says each hero may move up to three locations. Okay, Wonder says we don't hit him back, but I would like to appeal to a higher Correct. authority. Correct. <laughs> uh, Richard Lanius or the Saddlers, <laughs> please come in and, uh... All right, uh, so we can um, move up to three locations. Yeah, those, uh, those, uh, justice cards can be used for an extra die when fighting nice. one of the big bosses. Okay, nice, nice, nice. Okay. Do we want to move up to three locations? Like maybe to to punch somebody, uh, if that's possible. I don't know if any of them, nah, I don't think we're- I'm good to on uh, green. If we want to whoop on green, I, I, I'm moving I only over. have- I can't get I, to green, no. Two, three I could now. have two dice on green, but- Yeah, but we can save we can, up and we, we can, can all hit on green. The him, thing yeah. is, I really feel like we've wounded that yeah, stupid freight train. train. I, I feel like we should just keep wailing on the guy until yeah. we Yeah, I wish I had some red cards to be able to help out with that. Um, so now yeah, it's me? Actually, I have nothing. Well, it's you unless we want to move. I mean, if we're going to move, we need to do it right now. Oh, can we all move? We can all move up to three. Well, we, three I mean, locations. I'm gonna, oh, man, I'm, gonna, I'm at a bystander, though. Well, you don't need to move. I mean, um, I'm trying to think of where it might be helpful. I mean... Do we still need to clear out the anarchy stuff? Should we be trying to get rid of more of the scheme things? I, th I mean, I think... I think you should move. Yeah, but where? Do I'm you want to go to the yellow. bystander? I can and I'll to, move to yellow? I can do that. All right. I'll just go here to City Hall then. Yep. Okay. okay. I am Bunker. Do you have to be by yourself to heal? No. Uh, I don't think it says anything. At least mine doesn't. Well, then I'm just going to go... To but I, for me, I have to be in my alter ego one, phase to heal. Two, I don't know about you. Three. Right, I, I start in my alter ego, right? If you choose to, yeah. Yeah. Okay, cool. Well, I'll start like that then. And then I'll spend one to heal this away. Mm -hmm. And then I will use my... I'm not that close. Um, I think I'm going to take... Use this goggles, which doesn't take an action to take blinding speed back into my hand. Nice. Um, and then I'm going to roll against these green guys. Green guys. So I need two green dice. And one action for that. And one action for that. We haven't had any guys explode, at yeah, least. Yeah, That's pretty good. Yeah, yeah. 
Boom. So that's two hits, which knock these out, which finishes this off. Boom. Um, I can use this to add green dice, um, which I probably need to save for when we're fighting this guy. What does that do? How many does it add? Add two green dice to a green combat or skill test. Then discard the guard. Okay. So, I need so to you put that up, up in the justice area. In, in Do we draw a new justice when we finish him? That's a good question. Yes. Oh, I should get one. Yeah. yeah you, have an, you both have a new justice card. Cool. My visions of the future. Um, Not looking so good. No, I should probably go visit that lady. Oh, okay. Who are you after visiting? She's at the uh, Chatham Wineries. I think she's drunk. <laughs> sure. Um, sure. The problem is, is that there's a good chance that it advances the mastermind track Ooh. one space. All right. So if we if we ever unite, the Freedom Five unite, if we all go to the same space and each discard a card of a certain color, mm -hmm. we'll each get to draw three cards. Oh. Seems legit. And then I can uh, choose a discard, this justice card, to draw a new one. If I do it, oh, never mind, that's lame. Um, <laughs> that would move this up, which would be dumb. That's right. if I'm getting rid of it. Um, cool, so that was... My second action. What do I have to do to take care of these? You flip over a card. And it's going to be bad no matter what, but you mm -hmm. just have to suck it up. Yep. Okay, let's do it then. Do it. Flip over that scheme card, Roy. Let's see what happens. Oh, it just does? Not it activates the scheme? No, 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 no. Flip over the oh, token. flip over the token. That's right. Yeah. We're doing that. Two. Not a scheme card. The Baron's misdirections have cost you precious time. Choose one of these, then discard the token. Advance the mastermind token one space. Oof. Or draw the next scheme card and do everything on it. Oof. And this could do that. Could. And it could I, I say move it one space. Yeah, I, that's so, You're going to be drawing one of those anyway. Right. Ugh. I know. But hey, we got rid hey. of the scheme token. It that's just right. goes, they, they get like there's, shuffled here every time you put one out. There's no positive thing on that one though, right? Nope. There's no positive on almost any of these. The one he did was okay. Um, we're going to do some blinding speed moves here. Um, where do I need to clean stuff up? Uh, in the kitchen. Uh, number three. Because oh. you're the best at yeah. No, Tom's the best at yellow. I'm off. I can just yellow. move there and kill one, just just without rolling. Mm -hmm. Or I could just move somewhere else and kill. I actually, I think I'm just gonna move over here. I should note that if you're backing it, there's actually an attack action to this guy. Pre miniatures pre-painted. That for would be some sweet. Of us, what do you need? Yeah, that'd be it's awesome. A big I deal. need a red die. One. Yeah, I'm gonna try to take care of this anarchy token. Now, do you get rid of that red guy? That's what I'm, I didn't oh, play my card. Got it. I saved it because we might need it to right, attack That was an action to do that. Did you spend yep. it? And then my last action, I'm going to try to take care of this anarchy. Got it. So we'll hit, we're at a plot point with one more movement of the mastermind track there. Anarchy. A violent mob is looting local stores and attacking citizens. You must intervene carefully. Three dice. Okay. Uh, and you're rolling against red. Dispatch yeah? the mob. That's fine. Uh, what do I need to get? One is or two for, successes. One is okay. Is this off of based off red, right? Yes. Okay, I need threes. Boom! All threes. You quickly restore order, gaining information about local villains from some witnesses. Draw two ability cards and remove this anarchy token. Nice. I'll do it. Very nice. All right. Now I'm we, really good at green right now. Now we've got the baddies turn. Oh, yeah, did you draw two more cards and then your turn? And then I draw two cards, which sure puts me draw. at 11. Nice. Who shuffled the scheme deck? There are some cards in that do nothing. Oh. Wow. Let's fight green, guys. Yellow to eight and a bystander to eight. Yellow to eight and a bystander to eight. Okay. Two reds to 14. Let's move that bystander to eight. All right, so now we have our first pop here, folks. The, there we go. That, yeah. So here's what happens. When we put... More, you can only have three in the spot. We're supposed okay. to put a fourth one there. Yeah. So instead, we put that on this guy's card, <laughs> oh. making him stronger. Um, and also, we pop to the adjacent locations. So red, red, and thirteen and nineteen. Hey, do we got a red guy in our tower? We do. Goes up here. <gasps> Wait, thirteen? Yeah. Then a red in twenty-two. All right. And we would move the red guy there, but we're not going to because it has to be three henchmen. If three or more mastermind tokens are active, which they are, remove one and advance the scheme track one space. All right, so we're hitting a plot point. Which one do we want to get rid of? I try to get rid of some scheme. You're on one there. Maybe yeah, this one? Yeah, that's the farthest one away. Right. All right, unfortunately, we now turn the page. <laughs> Chapter two. Mm -hmm. I grew up alone with nothing, watching as the Parsons defended a city full of impudent, wasteful pigs. 
He's so dramatic. This what did you boy. do, Mike? What did you do to this man? Said, Look, we're misunderstood. Grab your bootstraps. <laughs> pull yourself up. <laughs> right. All right. So now we're drawing two cards in the villain face. Oh. No. Uh, and we'll do everything on the first one. On the second one, we only do the top and bottom. Mm. Okay. But we only do the event if it's related to mastermind tokens. Special rules for this one. Villain standees, each standee that you take as a reward can be spent to fight Baron Blade to do two damage. Each justice card can be a die against... Okay, the justice cards are the same. Okay. When we resolve a mastermind token, if you roll one, you take a damage. Devious traps. But now, there's a side quest. Oh. Put this on 27 and 2. So there's 2 and 27. Okay. Uh, a hero can exhaust an action and discard an ability card while on those locations to take a quest token. Mm. Also, the uh, the numbers have changed now. What do quest tokens do, you might wonder? I might wonder. I, I thought you might, and so I had the answer the not side ready. side quest. Dun, 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 dun. Scheme cards. Uh, oh, at the end of the scenario, we will get rewards or fail if we've... <laughs> If we've done the side quest or not, so uh, let's let's play non knowledgeable. Okay. We'll find out what happens when we flip the page. Okay. I really don't know. Okay. Uh, good news, everyone. The uh, project has funded, so oh. that's all for that. Nice. So bag it. Link in description. Yes. All right. So have we done? We've we've done. Oh, and also don't take our uh, gameplay as indicative of uh, good gameplay. <laughs> no. Because we are. Getting our butts kicked. We are currently. getting wrecked. Have we done anything really useful? We need to team up. We've done some damage to free. We tried to manage some stuff. Yeah. Superpowered people do not team up. Mm. Uh, I can, Mike teamed up. You're the one who's not I can working move, together. I can move three spaces during somebody else's turn if we want to work together. I think to you should go to the. Well, okay. I think I'm we really should get that green guy. I'm First really good at green right now. It's my turn though, right? Yeah. One, two, three, maybe we should four, all five. hit the green guy. Six. Okay. I can get uh, six okay dice green. against green. Okay, so first thing we need to do, I'm going to flip over to my alter ego side and sense danger. Let's look at the top scheme card and see if we want to get rid of it. Seems good. Whoops, I should have been on this side. So let's Ooh. see. Ooh. Oh, this is a personal task. We're getting rid of that. <laughs> So, for those of you watching, mm -hmm. well, personal task, you have these cards that draw, and they fill your special slots. Oh, no. And you cannot... Use that special slot until you deal with until you that. deal with the personal task, which gives you no reward. No, like mine here says, you got to meet some visiting senators. So I'm gonna know fighting, and they're like right. the senators are here to meet you. <laughs> Stupid senators. I don't want to do that. Okay, <laughs> so now I'm gonna heal, um, which these actually are over here. I'm gonna spend one action to heal, heal two damage. All right, so this comes back to me, and these go away. Boop. All right. Someone in the Someone says, you, uh, Arcane Wonder says, you really need to take out a villain. Each villain's carrying crystal power in the mobile defense platform. Yes, it, it takes like seven hit points right. off. Also, oh. we know. <laughs> we know we're supposed to take out a thing. All right, so now I feel like I should do this bystanders. End your turn on green. End my turn on green? Yeah, so we can work together to fight them. Okay, so one, two, I can do that in two actions. That, But I'm going to end up, I'll have to deal with those dudes because I'm going to end up getting a, a damage. Fight them! So take a damage then, you all whiner. Alright, I'll take a damage. Let's deal with these. Let's get these <laughs> Let's get these uh, bystanders. A news reporter. Each hero may discard one to two ability cards and draw the same number from their deck. Oh. Ooh. One to two. And you said you want to fight green. I'm only going to discard one. I think I'm going to swap out yellow to try to get more of the colors that are actually um, used for fighting these villains. Gosh, I kind of like my cards. Right? And some of them have, like, two dice on them, too. Right. All right, I'll discard this to draw this. Oh, good. Oh, that's great. Okay, I got a flight. Okay. I never really do well these games because the same thing always happens. Oh, I keep you this. really should go fight these main villains and I get caught up you doing the small stuff. Like, ah, stuff. I'll punch these henchmen. Okay. Ah. So this comes off, right? Yeah. Yep, yep, yep. You, right. rescued it. you rescued a news reporter. I did. I think he, what I'm going to do... Always there for the scoop. He's like, by the way, how do you make sure you spell legacy correctly? You're coming correctly. to green. I can come to green right now. Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to play my flight as one action to fly there. Got it. Okay. 
Oh, you're saying that no matter what, you're going to take one damage? Yeah, because I... No, I'm not now, because I played... I got just drew that flight card. Got it. Oh, I see. So now I'm going to attack red, which is going to give me this and this. Oh, man. I really like your ability. I do, too. Red's gone. Now I'm going to attack double. green. Just roll the same dice. Green's gone. Good job. Boom! That just happened. All right. Draw two cards. I'm going to play this during your turn, just to... Move to here, man. I like yellow it. And pushing the limits. Yellow and mastermind at twenty-one. Yellow and mastermind at twenty-one, which is right here. Wait, how many yellows? Just one. And then two blues. Oh, and then, yeah, and then two blues on four. Oops, he died. I agree. Do we know where this was? Yeah. Two okay. blues on four. Ah, the blue guy gets a buffed up. Darn. Yeah. And there's blues all over the place. Yeah, this isn't looking. Now, does that explode too? No, 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 because it's, it's only not blues. Color. Okay. And got then it. a red to number one. Okay, and then we're doing a second card. No, we got to draw and activate the top personal task card. No! No, wait, let me look at personal tasks. Are they all in one deck or. Or because it says draw and do. Do we all draw one? It might yeah. be the player. Yeah, I guess it's you, so... Ah. So it covers up my first two special slots, is that right? No, just one of them. Why would uh, it cover up two? I don't know, because it looks like it's that big. Okay, so... I have to... Uh, discard a red ability card at Freedom Tower. To get All right, there. good news. That was only the first one. Great! Second one, two blues on 19. Um, which is here. On Freedom Tower! Uh, guys, we're almost out of blues. I'm aware. So we had to take out some blues. And then the here, bottom right? thing. If three or more mastermind tokens are active. They are. Remove one, advance a scheme. <laughs> Let's get rid of that one. Wrecked. All right. All right. <laughs> We're doing great. All right. I feel like the crazy thing is I feel like I've had great turns. I don't think like I've had one bad turn. Not all of us have great turns. Are you turns. coming right. up here to fight green during your turn? What's it? Yeah, can you come up here? just like. I thought I was going to go up there and then you would join us. I'm already there. Oh, oh nice! nice. <laughs> okay. Well, first of all, who needs more? Do you have any green? I've got lots of green I played cards. my card to move three spaces. I know, I but I, need, I, I need one of you to. I need one of you to draw cards and get green. Who has a better chance of getting a green card? Oh, oh I my, already have a ton of green my cards. Draw three. A ton of green cards, but okay. I I have one, two, three, four, five draw green cards. Draw three one, cards, two, Mike. Three, four, five green cards. I'm, I'm, three. I'm, I'm, I'm trusting Mike. I need you to get a green card. One green All right, card. Well, you get to keep it. I know, but that was scary. And then I fly up there. Yeah, let's do this. Oh, hang on, I actually might want to heal myself. We're going to end them. The question is, how many do we really want to do? All of play? them. I'm gonna how many hit points one. does it have? Seven. Seven. Oh, yeah, yeah but, but this guy's hard to hit. Heals. This guy, uh, attacking heroes suffer damage for each one, and he's going to hit us all back for four damage. Oh, my gosh. Yeah, but I, I don't want him to get away. I'm sorry. Look, if we lose this game... We are killing somebody. All right, so uh, I'm hang going on, all hang in. Hang on, okay, hang on. I'll go all in too. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. I'm gonna roll seven. I'm Wait, gonna be four, rolling one, five, two, three, six, four, seven, five, six, seven. I'll be rolling. I'll be rolling. Hang on, hang on, hang on. Two, three, four, there, five, guys, six, seven. Guys, there is such a thing as overkill. Okay, right. but the thing is, we can discard a card of a color um, if we're all at the same space, um, and then we can draw three ability cards with this here. But we need to do that after because my hand's too big right, currently. Right. This will help us draw our hands back up. Is it bad if our deck runs out though? Wait, how are we cheating? Oh, do we have to play a special card to be able to? Uh... It says you can only have three henchmen on location. Oh, three total? Oh. So here, eight and 19. Yeah, but how do you know which color explodes at that point? And also, would we just lose, or does that advance the thing when you can't put a henchman out? Oh, that's different than the... Uh, uh, yeah, anytime it has... Oh, of any color. Apologize. I am just assuming previous rules take place. Man, we got three locations now that are above three. All right, well, we know which ones they were, though. They just don't go on? They go here. Oh, oh. Okay, so a lot is actually happening yeah, here. Yeah, yeah. Um... Well, good. That was just during the last card draw during your turn. Mm -hmm. 
Yeah, but the henchman that triggers it then busts from those the spots too. So where was the the red one was in the blue, right? It was here. Was he on Freedom Tower? Yes. Oh, you know what though? No, it wasn't red. It was blue. I know for sure because we started with that stupid red guy there. Yeah, yes. yeah, yeah. So blue goes here, and then blue goes to all the adjacent spots. Well, I just throw blue or red. We don't have blue. Oh, all it's right. not good. Hang on a second. <laughs> we may lose the game we right may here. Lose actually, right here. <laughs> um, if I don't have hen I need I need Arcane Wonders here to walk me through this. I don't know what happens first. I think this, because these blue would come back. Um, when there's three henchmen on oh, a the location, yeah, okay, that happens right away. Okay, so they come back. And then we put an anarchy token on that villain's location. So wherever that blue one is. Blue's up there. Okay. So blue goes up here. So then I have these back. Okay. To go one, two, three. We need one more. We need one here. Now we don't have one. We don't have one. We put out an anarchy token of that color instead. Okay. Where? There. Okay. Oh, scary. Okay. So now green was the other one, right? There was two greens here. Mm. No, it wasn't green. It was this blue. That blew up. Oh, they were reds. They were reds. Was it blue? It was this that blew up. So it was also it was blue, blue again. Yes. We're all bad at blue. Oof. Huh. Okay. Um. And I don't have one to put here, so then we have to put. Wait, that wasn't three there though. No, this busts into all three of those. Oh, gotcha. Oh no, no, it came from here. I keep messing up. So the first one went here. Which busts, so we put one here and one here. This one also busted. We put one there, we don't have, so the mastermind track moves up one. We put one here, we don't have, the mastermind oh track moves gosh. up one. And that triggers that, which triggers the next part of the story. <laughs> yeah. Ah, we just wanted to kill one guy. I would wow. like to say that um, I'm really going to whoop that guy now. Yeah, I, remember yeah, I was yeah. talking about overkill? I lied. Yeah, we need to do something here. This is ridiculous. Okay. We're um, wrecked. Wait, where am I here? There we go. Flipping we're the working page. on trying to keep henchmen. Fools, down, they think they've won. No, I don't, I don't think we will. No, nah, we don't think that. Not so much. <laughs> um, what happened to the. Uh, where's the side quest? Side quest up here. If yeah, but what happens? If we side quest, then we fail. Well, shouldn't it say something about the side quest? I don't know. Oh, it's been back here. Oh, it's at the very, very end. Uh, I see. The side quest here is actually for the campaign. Oh, I see. So we ain't doing no side quests. No, we, we, <laughs> we have no time. Barely to. hanging on to the main quest. I think we've already failed that main quest. It's close. Like we've got an urgent dispatch from Arcane Wonders HQ. Tell me I can play all these green dice. I just want to roll them all at the same time and wreck. Uh, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on, blah, 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 blah. I'm ready to fight Only this guy. Only do the step on the top of the second card, and then the event if it relates to the mastermind. Which is what we did. No, we did this running out of time, so this is actually here in seven. Oh, is that all? Beautiful. Oh, good, good, good. I'm ready for this. You can't trigger subsequent overruns, just the one ignoring the ones that happened from the original. So if they burst, right. they won't burst again. So let me go back and read that again, just to make sure I have it right here. Henchman overrun. Do not uh, place them in the overrun. Place one henchman of the color in each. If they're already, do not create an overrun, but add one henchman to their villain or mastermind. Got it. Okay. So we don't have all these tokens here. Oh, gotcha. Because okay. this exploded into these, so that wouldn't then explode ah. again. So we're not as bad off as we thought. Can we please? I swear, if I get one more comment, we are now going to kick this green guy's butt. Right. All right, back off and let us fight him. Let's punch I'm me. not playing everything. I wasn't going to, but I wasn't. I am now. <laughs> okay, so uh, how many? The problem is if we roll ones, we're going to take a bunch of damage. One, Don't three. even care, Roy. All right, hold on a second here. Four, five, six, seven, eight. I'm rolling eight. One, two. <laughs> how much? How many hit points does he have? Need? Seven. <laughs> but does he have any defense? He does. So you're rolling how many? <laughs> I need fours though, so that makes it hard. Okay. Yeah, but one, Roy's one, two, three. So if I roll eight, that means I should get four 
at least. Four at least hits, because that's 50% chance, right? I'm having you roll first, because you can re-roll. Right. How many dice you get? Eight. I'm thinking about rolling five. Does that seem legitimate? Yes. Okay, I'll do that. Okay. All right. All right, this is going to be enough to do it just right here. Not quite. I didn't get Why did you roll on the board? Because I needed to. You need to roll, uh, what, fours? You got three hits. You, you get a re-roll, hits. dude. Four oh, hits. you're afraid to roll ones? Right, but it says you may re-roll all dice once. Oh, then forget that. And I Four got 50% is, 50% off. is good. And no ones. And no ones. Right. That's four hits. Four hits. All right, Mike, your turn. Finish them right. off. So I'm rolling five. One, two, if you can throw me three more. And I don't, oh, and I don't want ones. I want uh, fours or higher. Oh, my gosh. I only got two there. Do I want to re-roll? How many more hits does he need? Lane. That's five. He needs... Wait, you got four, five, six. You'd only need one hit, and you're rolling three dice? Yeah, <laughs> but I need fours also. I don't know. I don't think I should re-roll on this. Do I only need one if I do it? I think you only need one. because Four, I've got, five, six? I'm doing two damage to it, right? Oh, yeah, sure. There's no way I can mess up. <laughs> All right. Let me look what I got here. Oh, my word. All right. How many did you hit? Two. How many more do we need? One. Hold Please on, tell hold me on, you can let on, me re-roll. Come on! Dice. Play during another hero's turn to enable them to re-roll all their dice. All right. I say, that's why I saved that. All right. All right. All right. All right. All right. Oh, my word. <laughs> you still take a damage, but... Oh, I do. Not only did I take a damage, but now we all take... We killed him. Mm -hmm. We all so, take two? Hang on. So, first of all, we all take... Four damage. Oh, oh holy gosh. smokes. Four for you. Four for you. And I take five, which actually is going to kill me. Really? Well, not kill me. Knock me out. Um, I can't play any But we also though. get two rewards. They must be different rewards. So oh, all of us get these rewards. So there's a benefit to us all working together. Draw two special cards. Keep one. Remove all green anarchy tokens on the board. There's like none. Remove up the six green henchmen. Meh. Draw four ability cards. And take a villain token. I think one of us... I'll get rid of the green. Or one of us should get rid of the green. Right? Uh, sure. Even though green's not that threatening... I mean, at least they're gone, right? And this space has three guys, so we definitely need to clear it out. My ticket, my family photo tickets that I keep in my hat <laughs> from when I went to Santa's Enchanted Forest in December fell out of it. They're As you can see. I heard they were closed for good. Did you? I'm sorry to bring you down after all of this. <laughs> <laughs> take that figure off the map. All right, He's get dead. that garbage out of here. Who gets to take that? Okay, so what are the what are the uh, rewards? I need to look up and see what happens to me first, because I, I I I did. Uh oh. Because that may that's gonna hurt us a little bit. All right. Before uh, you die, while we're all in the same space, I want to do my card. It's not gonna happen because you're gonna die before we when can do it. When this says times two, does this mean you put two action tokens on there? What's it say? It just says times two. Place an action token on this. I guess so. You don't get to do anything anymore. Well, seriously, yeah, I don't. Okay, so one. All right, if I don't take five tokens, that's me. One, two. Um, How do we heal you? Then, uh, I don't know, because it takes okay, an action gonna, to heal. If I take that, Ugh. I'm knocked unconscious. I don't understand how that works. You're wrecked. Move my character to, to one of the home base list on the hero board. So I'm going to Freedom Tower. So I'm going okay. to Freedom Tower. Discard all damage tokens on them. So that's good. And the Mastermind goes up by two. I think we're going to lose. Can you double check and make sure, Tom, does this mean I'm two action tokens go on there? Yes. Okay, so what do I do now that I can't heal because all of my action tokens are gone? Same thing. I'm out too? Yeah, when all your action tokens are locked up, it says... Okay, so oh, I that's also game, right? go... Well, I don't know, actually. Um, when the mastermind gets to 10, I'm going to flip the page. Okay. Dun, dun, dun! It just wants you to read the, uh, right. you guys lose. <laughs> Listen, if we're going to lose, we're going to go out on our own terms. That's right. I think he flips on 10, doesn't he? <sighs> oh, 
All I know is it's not good for Mike because he was mad no. at you. Right. Listen, I'm fast. I can just run out of here. I can get out of here. I can go have dinner. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Uh, He'll never catch me. Once again, need uh, some rulings here. Um, so if, what happens when he flips? We're in the end game now. Yeah. yeah so he flipped because me I'm, and Mike I'm both locked. died. So I go there. I get rid of all this stuff. Is that right? All of these. Yeah. Yeah. You're healed up. And does my personal task go away too? It didn't say that. Mike. I don't think that goes away. Hey, those people still want to talk That's to you. That's annoying. They don't care how exhausted you are. <laughs> that is annoying. All right. Oh, it's brutal. Well. That was fun. So whose turn is it? <laughs> I need to, uh, he flips on 10 and follow what the comic and his card says. He flips on 10. Oh, okay. Here we go. Move Baron Blade and all heroes to Freedom Tower 19. Okay, here Move we go. Move us all there. He activates his scan. Each character discards a yellow ability card if you have one. I do, unfortunately. I don't. I don't. We must attack. Oh, okay. So this is like the final battle. So when he gets a 10, we had to be ready to fight him. Oh, and I'm not because I have zero yellow can we get cards. Our, can we get our rewards? We didn't get our rewards. That's for, true. We're taking our rewards. Can we draw rewards. our four cards of a reward? Mm. All right. Uh, yeah, that's what I'm, Well, we would have got these, but we also then have to we draw discard four? a yellow. Oh, I, <laughs> I got one yellow. I'll one, discard two, three. it. Well, I, I did discard one, but I can shuffle these to get another one. To get Also, another one. we have that. Oh, and I'm also. We're all the same space. I'm taking the two specials and keep one. Wait, do we get two rewards? Yeah, you get two rewards. Well, I can't. The special doesn't help me because it's blocked. You have another two oh, more spots for specials. Oh, you, it, it doesn't block You just can't have three. Yeah, it just blocks God. one of your Can things. I take okay. a special? I'll take a special, too. Can you give me a special, then? You get two and keep one. No, oh, even better. Oh, cool. I'll take two and keep one as well. All right. I feel like we're going to lose, but we're going to make him cry. Also, part of his mobile platform blew up. He takes seven damage. His mobile platform is now down to yes, 13. Yes, that's right. Da -na 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 -na. Na -na 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 -na. Okay. So they said we have no way of beating him, sadly. You don't know that! Who said that? Deus Ex Machina! You're wrong. All right. Probably right. Okay, so how do we do this? Okay, so... <laughs> We might not be able to beat him, but we can do mean things to that miniature. I'm just kidding. All right, to fight him, where is his card? Okay. We have to fight this thing first. If right? the mobile defense platform is active, we got to do hit that first. If he's directly attacked, not defeat it, uh, he's going to kill us. Okay. Um, uh, seriously. So um, I believe we need to hit him with yellow dice. If I'm, I would have are zero. Are we hitting him or are we dice? hitting the, the Well, that too. Defense. Okay. I have no cards for that, but happily I get four dice from my specials. Okay. I get four dice. I get two dice and I get three. Actually, one, two, three, four, five. I'll take I get one, six dice. I'll take one die. <laughs> Hang on. Do you anyone have special things? Oh, never, 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 I do have. I oh, feel six is counted. Two successes, baby. Redirecting power. I feel, I feel dumb about uh, discarding all my yellows earlier. This was changed to a random ability card. Okay. Oh, wait, what color are we using to fight him then? We get to pick a color? We get to pick? Oh, well, that changes everything. I mean, we'll whoop on him then. I don't know about that. Shut up. Um, I say red. Okay, so I'm rolling two. I only have. We're all good at I red. Have, I have, yeah, I am better at red. I've got three dice I can roll for that. I will get one, two, three, four, five, six. I'll get six dice if we go red. Two, four, five. I'll get six as well. And can I? So, is this take? Do we have actions? Because I have cards that allow me to do stuff. All right, all right, all right. Commit bonus dies. They must match the color of the villain or mastermind being attacked. Well, how do I know what color he is? Man, these cards yellow would have been so specials. amazing earlier. Plus additional dice for justice cards you completed. So it is yellows. Okay, it is yellows. But. Okay, so I got four. Oh, you finished a justice card, didn't you? Hmm? Yeah, you got uh, that yes. one. Okay. So, can we do this at any time? My justice card? That adds an extra die. No, the justice card. Oh, uh, no, you got to do it in your turn. And I'm also assuming I can't... It's technically my, <laughs> it's technically my turn. I want to be guessing, able to draw cards. I'm guessing I can't do these things that allow me to do stuff, right? Uh, if it says you can play on anyone's turn, I suppose. No, no, it's my, it's my turn. No, it's my turn this whole time. It's been my turn. 
Oh, it has. Whose yeah. turn has it been the whole time? Okay, okay. Your turn. Mine! All right. All right, All right so sixes count doubles. Okay. okay, I get one die. Mike is rolling five. Six. I'm rolling f oh, six. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, plus one because of my legacy ability. And I'm rolling. We gotta zoom into this final showdown. Four. So that's ten dice. And Roy's rolling one. So I got oh, this. Oh wait, I don't know that I can because I was I on my. Why would I have been here? You're not. Just I'm not. I'm rolling an extra die. All right. So I'm rolling six. One, okay. Two, now three, let's four, hang on here. If we roll all sixes. Let's beat this guy up. Okay. Let me, let me do some math here. Okay. So you have seven dice, right? No, I have one, two, three, four, five, six. Six, and I have four. That's ten and eleven. If we roll eleven sixes, that's twenty-two damage. We need thirteen plus seven. That's twenty. 20. You so said it was impossible. It is not mathematically impossible. It if is we, possible. If we roll all sixes. I still need one more die, so I'll wait till you guys are done. Well, you should have said it was improbable. <laughs> Nothing is impossible. Roy, go ahead. All right, here comes six the first six. six. Oh. Two. Oh. It was a six for a brief what? moment. <laughs> no. I'll All right, well, I'm going to beat snot it. out of him with my four dice. Come on, come on, come on. And these are yellows? Oh, I need fives. I got three hits. I got two hits. Three. Three hits. Five hits on the middle station. That's four, isn't it? Five. Because you got a five, a six, and a four, right? He's, well, no, he I need sucks five. Oh. That's 12 damage to the station. We still need it. 16 more. Dun, da, 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 da. Yes. All righty. Well, that's how you play, folks. <laughs> uh, <laughs> oh, wait, let's rephrase that. That's not how you play. Okay, that, well. That's how you lose. I got some really good cards that would have been amazing. Out. Yeah. We. Like this I hypersonic charge. Is amazing because I can move three spaces and kill a a a henchman in each one I go through. Yeah. That, and I didn't draw these until we later on. That would have been so good. We needed to go after these villains earlier. We needed to, to oh, team sure. up and and punch the villains earlier. Collect a bunch of the same color and jump them. I don't know if we should have killed the green one. His teaming up on him is bad. Yeah. We should have teamed up on the blue one. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Because that hitting us all for damage is what made the bad guy win. Right. Yep. Well, I'm just but we took we'll, someone down. We'll know better. That's true. That's time. true. That's true. Okay. So anyway, folks, this is on Kickstarter right now. Mm -hmm. You can uh, see a, a link in description. It's already funded. Let me just check to see if it didn't defund. Thanks for crushing the fee. <laughs> no, still funded. Good. Yep. Good. <laughs> and um, already. Uh, more live things coming up later today. I'll be on Rado's channel for Rado Runs Through at 2 o'clock. We'll be talking about games that are being released at Digital Essen. We got some uh, no... I believe there's a there might be a live play tonight. I'm not sure, but definitely at nine o'clock tomorrow mm. we start digital spiel. We'll be playing through lots and lots of games. We will be doing our best to win a few of them. Yes, <laughs> unlike today. But that's how you play Freedom Five. Until next time, I'm Tom Vassell. I'm Mike Delicio, and I'm Roy Kennedy. Have fun crushing the bad guys.